Hey guys, iHeartMovies here, and welcome back to Let's Play Wild Arms. In the last episode, we learned a new fast draw hint for Jack, which I still haven't tested out yet. And we got sucked into the gate generator by Zeke and now we're still kind of exploring the part right now. And, well, we've seen Zed, too. He stopped by to say hi. And by hi, basically, he means electrocute us with Operation Hell Thunder. Or, in this case, Operation Run the Hell Away and be a little pansy. And we're fighting random battles. Yay! Anything new here? Um, nope, nope, nothing new here. And too slow. Oh my goodness gracious. Well, time to endure some annoying status ailments and physical attacks, which will do like 283 damage, something like that. I don't know. I'm just throwing out a random number out there. I don't know. And you're healing? Why? The battle just started. Uh, whatever. Aha! Miss. You suck. And run away! Please, thank you. Night out here. Silence, even though silence on Rudy, it doesn't matter one freaking bit. But just because OCD and RPGs, I kinda have to. Where? There, Violet Rose. There we go. And yeah, what? Okay, there we go. Trying to find the stairway down to that switch over there. So let's go ahead and uh, flip that and see what happens. Will we do candy? I hope so. Oh, that didn't do anything. Okay, well, let's fall and uh, end up right back here. Okay. Let's see, the switch is still activated. Okay, good. And in the meantime, another random battle. And let's see, Dan Terry and Leprechauns. Yeah, I thought you guys before, so bye. Too slow again. Oh my goodness gracious. Well, you know what? I'll just go ahead and kill these guys. They won't take that long. Because yeah, you remember I fought this one battle formation in the last episode. And Prism Ray did out the three Leprechauns, and just physical attacks on the Dantarian was more than enough to take him out, so. I mean, he, he silenced me with a wrench? Um. Okay. Um, uh, whatever. I was gonna nod my head and agree. Just. Yeah. Ow. Haha, your wrench, it does nothing. Uh, let's see. Um. Yeah, Prism Ray. Yeah, for, whatever the hell it is. And physical attacks for the win. And, of course, the mage meows. Of course. I'm, I mean, why not, right? Rainbow? This could potentially hurt. Uh, potentially... Actually, yeah, I kind of sort of did. Stop hitting me with wrenches. At least use a pipe or something. I'll probably hurt more. Or, I don't know, less. Depends on what the wrench is made out of. What the hell am I even talking about? I'm just rambling. I don't know. Yay! Victory is ours. Suck it. Oh, I did a bullet flip. Yeah, I went through that a little fast, so... Alrighty, uh, Violet Rose. I actually remember this time. There we go. Okay, let's, um, let's go down this way. And let's see. Yep, no, another lever. L another lever. Blah, blah, blah. And... Oh, there's a, there's a pole over there. Okay. Can I reach from over here? I think I actually did this in the wrong order. No. Oh, okay, I guess that works too. Okay. Yeah, then you're actually supposed to hit the uh, the bottom one first, and then this one, so you can grapple your way across. I, I, apparently, it doesn't really matter. You can just fall, and you'll be just fine. Run away! Thank you. And let's see if that did anything. Oh, open the door over here. Fantastic. What do we got over here? We have a crest graph. Yay. Secret sign. More yay. And a bullet clip. More, more yay. Okay, let's get the hell out of this room. Actually, just use the pocket watch. No point in walking back, you just use the pocket watch and... Boom, you're back. And let's see, from over here, let's go off to the east door now. Yeah, I stupidly used the roller skates here and fell into a abyss. Which, of course, I just ended up in the room right back where I started, so no big deal there. And, wow, well, I'm sensing deja vu, how about you guys? Let's see, let me check my status real quick while I have a minute. Um, okay. Yeah, what I may want to do, uh, depending on how far I get in this area in this episode, I may or may not want to do a little bit of level grinding. I Actually, I probably might. Well, will, really. Oh, some more chests here. What do we got? Potion berry. And another potion berry. And the force unit accessory. Let's see, let's find that. Let's go over what it does. Ah, uh, here we go. Enhanced force increase. Yeah, pretty much yeah, you equip that in battle and it'll increase how much force you get per round. So it can be useful. Um if you want to use it, go for it. I generally don't because um 
Each character has their own accessory anyway. Rudy has his shields, Jack has his arm his uh, arm guard thingies, and Cecilia has her books, so. What do we got here? Oh god, Fankelvine. That's definitely new. Well, let's un unload a rocket launcher into him. Because I, I have plenty of bullet clips, so I may as well use the ammo where I need to. And Amplifier. Yeah, we fought these before. You guys obviously remember that. The battle took like four and a half freaking minutes or however long it took. I don't know. I'm not counting. You guys shouldn't be either, so. Yay for rocket launchers and yay for exploding dragons with giant tusks or I, I don't know. Critical hits for the win. And you're still alive. That's not cool. And you're still alive. And you're putting me to sleep. That's fantastic. Well, hey, hey, at least it missed Rudy, so. Haha, <laughs> that worked out perfectly. 10,000 experience! Damn, yeah, I am so training here. I'm almost tempted just to screw around and do nothing for the rest of the episode so I can train here. Oh, did I test you for? Ooh, a nectar! I think that's our, is that our first nectar? Yes, it is. Recover status and match HP. Now, that's only for one person. But obviously, with Cecilia's Mystic, you can use on everybody. And what's going on down here? Zed, what are you doing? Is that where you hide your porn? Oh, uh, yeah, I guess so. Now, it seems like there's, there's a little button on the wall down there. Now, let's run down over there and check. Let's see, where was that? It was right about here. Yep, there's a, oh, a lever, not a button. Well, excuse me, princess. And what are we done here? Oh, stairs. That's melodramatic. And let's see, I want to do a little bit of healing up real quick. There you go. Alright, how am I doing experience-wise? Nowhere near, close, and close. Fantastic. And another random battle. Anything new here? Otherwise, I would just run away. Um, these guys are not new, but I do want to fight them again, just experience-wise. Plus, it would get Rudy and Jack to level up anyway, so... Yeah, so I'll, I'll take the time to fight this battle. It won't take that long. Since, I mean, I have rocket launchers and they have umbrellas and tusks. Yeah, which one do you think is going to win? My money's on the rocket launcher. Nice. Almost 3,000 damage. Not even locked on for the uh, attack boost or anything either. And a round of physical attach should be enough. Another critical hit. Damn, that's fantastic. Silence, I hear you! Yeah, that's my Osh Med, the dead terrorist impersonation. And, oh no, you silence Rudy. Now I won't be able to use his arms. Oh, yes you will. The silence doesn't work that way on Rudy. You stupid cat magician umbrella thing. 10,000 experience points. Even more fantasticness. Now, the one to... Actually, since, since this area is a really good place to train, what you can do is, um... If you have a lucky card, uh... If you want to duplicate it to make 255, uh, go for it. Because obviously you see the experience points come out here out the ass, so... I mean, why not? And, oh, we've got a little door puzzle here. Okay. Alright, well, that lever opens that door. Made sense. And uh -huh, that opens that one. I'm, no I'm noticing a trend. How about you guys? Uh huh. Well, me thinks this lever will open this last door. And it did. And there's Zed. Hi, Zed. And, you bastard! I hate you! You locked us in here! Um... Whoa! Well, what can we do now? We're stuck! And, no, I'm not cliffhanging you guys here, I'm just gonna use the watch. I still have plenty of time left in the episode anyway, so I'm not gonna cliffhang you guys there. I'm not HC Bailey. Just kidding, just kidding. Alright, now let's try this again. Let's use that one. And then let's try... The second one. And then let's go back to the first one. That will close the second one. And then let's see. Now let's open up this one. And let's see. Wait a second. Did I screw this up? I actually think I may have. Yeah, I think I did. This door needs to be closed right here, actually. Wait a second. Yeah, I screwed something up here. What the hell? Um. Crap. Hmm. You know, let's try, let me try this again real quick. My bad, guys. Oh, Jesus Christ, I still like this. Okay. Well, let's try opening this lever and then 
see what happens. And, yep, the exact same thing. Yeah, I am stupid. Yeah, okay then, guys, so, um, episode needs to stop here. So next time, guys, on Let's Play Wild Arms, I will actually figure out this damn door puzzle, and then we'll track down Zed. This has been IR Movies on Off, guys. Have a nice day, and thanks for watching.